Longest Arizona pass completed this year. The previous was 70 running out of that slot position and uh, he was the leading receiver with 17 catches, 263 coming in. Kyle Whittingham, by the way, looking for his 100th career win as head coach. But to do it, he's going to have to beat a team that he see here. A Ball start, 72 offense, five-yard penalty, makes first down. And that's Carrick Bowles, who's one of their real leaders up there playing that tackle position. So many guys are playing out of position, Spence, with uh, Nowakowski by Utah. Down, Utah. That's their first. Seven minutes of things you're looking at. This is an undersized defensive front that you're looking at right there. You want to make sure that you make solid decisions. The only thing I can suggest is that maybe they fear that athleticism and mobility against their larger, more physical, but less mobile front. And we've got a timeout taken by Arizona. You think of this uh, Utah run the football very effectively against his. What he wanted to do was control the ball. Well, up until the snap problem at the goal line in the red zone, he was doing just what he needed to do, keeping Arizona off the field. It really was. Again, off to the turnover on punt, they get quality field position and a negative play with a penalty. You know, Sam TV on that last plate got caught down. And these are veteran linemen. Yeah. Asiata, the senior, is one of their better guys. And it's. In that situation. Yeah, he's got the clearest line of sight to the big picture. And as Kyle will. That play, play will be, ex uh, penalty will be accepted half hmm. the distance to the goal. First down. That'll back him up again. Okay, it was Evan Moyai again. He does a couple of times. He's got, got called. Six penalties now. Five game last night that kept uh, a lot of people up late, even in this time zone, <laughs> with the Cubbies. The NLDS. And it's odd, and, and Kyle Whittingham can't really appreciate what's going on. And again, this is at home. This is not supposed to happen. I mean, it's not like you're dealing with crowd noise. This is your backyard. Five-yard penalty makes third down. Oh, it's off of the penalties. Facilitate this. You see a very frustrated play in the NFL. He's a tremendous athletic guy, maybe a little bit undersized. When they put about 15, 20 pounds on him, he's going to be a beast. But today... Well, he said that it had been declined, which it didn't make any sense to me. I don't believe he turned his microphone on to tell us that they, in fact, are taking it because that we've got another flag down in the backfield. And look at the look on his face. <laughs> Kyle Winningham in disbelief. Catch was made to get them into the red zone, down to the 13-yard line, and now 10 penalties. That's the call. Very quickly, Tate got the snap so that they could not get zone without that being a safety. And I believe that's what Whittingham and Arizona kicking. It's that simple. They missed it. By Tassini. They're in position here with great field position to score. Cut this baby to two by the break. And this is for a home team. I don't know that I've ever seen that. Certainly not from one of Been a rough go for his yeah. club. <laughs> Snap infraction, 75 offense. Five-yard penalty makes first down. It's happened so often. They Kowski, the center. And for those of you just joining us, as was outlined at the open, well, you, your suggestion that he didn't have control completely as he was inbounds, I, I would disagree with. I thought he had control, and he maintained it through the catch. Question would be, was the foot down? And I think it was. Let's see. After review, it was a completed catch. Ball be placed at the 35 yard line. Timer put nine seconds on. Get your guys, settle down, and we're going to be fine. As far as Rich Rodriguez goes, a play at the line of scrimmage in the red zone for that man's team tonight. Simulating our snap count and its disconcerting signals, we told the refs that should be an illegal procedure penalty on the defense, a five yard penalty, but it's up to the refs to call it. Well, therein lies why he was so hot in the first half. And he whipped on that. 
<laughs> cost them that. And he believed that it had a lot to do with decision making from Troy on one play and then their inability to get 15 additional yards. Late on injuries, Timmy, but I can oh. tell you this I've seen enough toughest, most competitive guys in the coaching business. And I asked him who on the team position you've broken the snide, gotten off the snide, and uh, that guy right there is happy for it. The one that had all that success in 2004 and then again in 2008 beat Alabama and went undefeated. Yep. You know, yep. Urban Meyer got it started. But that was at a different level of football. Yeah. He brought that edge. Whittingham kept that edge. But I, I loved your quote on it. He's, um, he's very much like Urban, but with but, but balance. Yeah. And that's exactly what he has. And I think tactically what he's done, he's dipped his toe down in uh, the Texas area for some recruits. You've been mentioning throughout the show, Dennis Erickson, the influence he's had in, in uh, Florida. I just think he's a hard worker. And he's a grinder. But he, your balance was more about the direction of uh, of the way he leads his off program. The field. Yeah, off the field. Absolutely. As I mean, opposed to the way you play on the field. He's a grinder, but you know, and, and Urban's on record of saying this, Urban was a big time grinder. There was no uh, capacity to discern how to he's slim down a little, little bit. bit. He's changed he a little has, bit but, you since know, he, he left. He had one motor, man. He's uh, Once they get into the spring, there's the remaining schedule we were talking about. That, that November 5th by date, they mm -hmm. can use it <laughs> sooner rather than later. Uh, and those are two games on the road before they come back against number five Washington here at the end of the month. And you win 100 games at one institution. That is a milestone. A very big milestone. And it is appreciated big time in the college game. 12 bowl wins since 1999. This program and some influential victories throughout those years that have shocked the college football world. Huge home victory. Both of these coaches, though,